And now we are going to play audience sound effects, uh, a game where Robert and Kevin will be performing a scene, but all of their sound effects will be provided by Richard and Dorian. Um, the suggestion for your scene is drive through coffee and ice cream shop. <laughs> that is your suggestion. This is audience sound effects. Begin. Yes, welcome to Starbucks 31 Flavors. We have just now merged. We are one now, one corporation, but we still have everything you need. What can I get for you today? Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Um, yeah, hi. Uh, could I get a, um, like, just maybe a quick explanation as to what all these buttons do? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is a new, uh, campaign we're doing. It's kind of like a pick your own adventure. So, like, say you want to do, like, a mocha mint flavored ice cream coffee. You know, you click on the mocha. <laughs> Mocha. And then you click on the mint. My, my, my mint. And then that tells us what you want. Oh, okay. So uh, that's that sounds really cool. It's just like I see all of the individual products, but I'm really curious about like what happens if I push the different sizes. Like I'm gonna push venti. I'm huge. <laughs> <laughs> See, that seems unnecessary. Uh, we're trying to be more. We're trying to be more inclusive. So, for the vision, in, visionly part of vision people out there, there are a lot of them. I know, and so we want to have a uh, an audio option for them if they don't know what the physical size of the shape looks like. So, you know, another example of that could be, you know. Like, I'm not sure how hot or how cold this beverage might be. So I'm going to push this button. You're going to die! <laughs> and then that will give you an idea. That seems very aggressive, but I think I understand. Like, I guess you kind of have to be like, um, so I've noticed that there's also caffeinated options. So if I push, like, let's say this button that says decaf on it. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Yeah, that makes sense. Right, right. Yeah, you know, we, uh, it's been really successful, this whole campaign. Uh, and, you know, sir, I'm gonna have to take your order because, you know, we have a whole line of people behind you. There's someone behind you, in fact, being really loud and obnoxious right now. I mean, I can hear them. Can you hear them? I need to order my You're Gonna Die, Venti! I'm huge! <laughs> so we need to, we need to move this along, sir. Yeah, no, it's just, like, I feel like if you wanted to optimize the speed at which the drive through goes, you wouldn't have so many options because, like, what I wanted cold brew, and I don't even see a button for that. I guess I could push this. Uh, ooh, polar bears. <laughs> I'd like the polar bears, please. Oh, uh, well, you know, they're going extinct soon, so we're actually running, we're, we're phasing that out, actually, that option, oh. polar bear option. Uh, but you know, uh, if you uh, click, on, you know, if you click on uh, the bottom row of the screen, we have our secret menu, which you'll only if you click on it. Wait, none of the buttons the are labeled. I guess I'll just try all tell of them. Anyone? Don't tell anyone. Dad, can we go home now? <laughs> no, no, we cannot. What kind of coffee do you want? Uh, frappe, I guess. Push a button, sweetie. Push. Yeah, this is delicious. I'm good to stay here for a while. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Great job, audience sound effects. Well done, Kevin, Robert, and the invisible but audible Dorian and Richard, uh, plus Mallory and Bob. Great job, everybody.